Hi, I'm Michael. Hi, And today we're going to teach you a new game called Five in a Row. Now, to play this game, all you need is a deck of regular cards, and we're going, we're only using the cards from one to ten. Okay, so uh, we've got school friendly cards. If you've got a regular deck of cards, you just go from ace to ten. And each player needs a game board. Now, a game board is just a five by five grid, like that, just drawn on some paper. And then at the start of the game, the players fill in their own game board. And we'll do that in a second, Nash. First, we'll just explain the rules. Now, the eight, five in a row, the aim of the game is to get five in a row. So five in a row horizontally, vertically, or diagonally. The first player to do that wins. Now, in order to cross a number off your board, on each turn, you get some cards. Now, if you don't have any cards in front of you on each turn, you would get two cards. And with those two cards, you can do any operation you want. So I could do six plus one, six take away one, six, six times one, six divided by one. And whatever the answer is, if you've got that number on your board, you can cross it off. Simple enough. Now, the other catch is, if you want to pass on a turn, you can pass. And when you pass, that means you don't cross out your number. You keep those cards in your possession that you can use on the next turn. And you pick up this card. But on the next turn, you would only get one additional card. So if you have any cards in front of you from a previous turn, instead of getting two new cards, you only get one new card. On that turn, you could use three cards to make one equation. You could use two cards. If you end up with four cards, you could do that to make one number and that to make one number. Okay, but I'm if you're use left, that to make ten. but if you're left with any cards in front of you on the next turn, you only get one card instead of two. Yeah. All right. Now the other really important feature of the game is that the players design their own board. Okay, and this is a really important. So each time we play Nash, we start with the blank board and we design it ourselves. Yeah. yeah. All right. So do you want to do start making your board? Yeah. All right. Okay, stop for a second, Daddy. Can you just tell me why did you put the 10 there? Why do you like that number? Because there's lots of ways to make 10. So can you, tell, can you tell us what are some ways that you can make 10? 5 plus 5, 7 plus 3, uh, 8 plus 2, yep. 11 minus 1. Uh, but there's no 11 card, remember? Um, yes. So can you do it with any multiplication? Uh, 2 times 5. Yep. Uh, 10 times 1. Beautiful. Okay. So now what happens is we can, so this is the strategy you want the players to be thinking of, like what, why they're choosing the numbers they're choosing. But that happens from playing the game lots, lots of times. So what happens now is we fill in our board. So Nasha, you do yours and I'll do mine. Okay, so as you can see, our boards are slightly different. We've got some numbers the same, some numbers different. We've got numbers in different I don't spots. Have 24. Yeah, which is what you would expect to see. I don't have 32, which is probably a good one to have. All right, so Nashi, you're going to go first or second? Second. All right, beautiful. So I take my two cards, one and nine. I'm going to go one plus nine is 10. I cross off the 10, and those cards go into the discard pile. All right, Nashi, your turn. Five. Let's put them over here, darling, so we can see them. I'm keeping them. You're going to keep them? Yeah, I wanted to get ten. Okay, you hold on to them then. All right, my turn. Eight and nine. So eight plus nine is 17. I'm going to do nine take away eight is one. All right, now, Nash, because you kept those two, what happens? I'm only picking this one. So can I get 13, 11, 14, I can get 3, where's my 3? Three? 3's there. Yeah, I'm going to do 3. And how are you going to make 3? 6 minus 3. Beautiful. Put that over here. Okay, my turn. 
So two and one. Um, I'm going to do zero. I'm going to go one plus two is three. All right, your turn, Nash. So yeah, you still only get one card here. This one, this one. Okay, so what are you going to do, Nashi? Make nine. Okay. Mm, where is my nine? Beautiful. Now you're still only going to get one card on the next draw, Nash, because you didn't, you didn't use all three. Nine and one is ten. Nine take away one is eight. That's pretty good. Yeah, I'm going to go nine take away one is eight. Your turn, Nash. Five of five is ten. Beautiful. And now you're back down to zero, Nash. So that means you'll be back to getting two cards. I really want a ten. Okay. Ten take away four. Give me six. Yeah, I'm going to go there. 10 minus 4 is 6. Here you go. 7 and 3. Mm, 4. Do I have any good cards in this line or this line? Mm. 7 plus 3 is 10 again. 7 lots of 3 is 21. Yeah, so that, that gives you 2 in that diagonal. Oh, yeah. Can I do that? Beautiful. Seven lots of three. It's 21. Great job. All right, seven ones is seven. That's okay. Uh, or seven take one is six. Seven plus one is eight. So basically, I really want that seven. Or do I want to keep them? I think I might keep these, Nash. What do I... No, I'll do 7 plus 1. Uh, 7 times 1 is 7. All right, your turn, Nashi. Uh, Can you reach him? I'll do it. Oh, good. 11. Can I get one for 40, 6, 5, or 18? What are you working out, Dally? 22 or 28, 11. So you can get 11. What else can you do? Can I... Lots of three, three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-four. What I don't have twenty-four on my board. Eight share between three. I need something of eight things. Now, should I just tell you eight share between three is not going to give you a whole number? I do well that there. Oh yeah. Okay, so the other what have you? So you've done plus to multiply. Minus the, it. Yeah. Eight minus three is five. I will keep that. Five is good. <laughs> so you've got three in a right, three in that line now, Nash. Okay, my turn. Two and eight. A oh, two lots of eight is sixteen. Nashy, what? I've got four in my line. Look, do, 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 do. I only need the two now. Yeah, but two is hard to get. So. All right, your turn. Ten and four is fourteen. Okay, that's good for you. Dot crosses. Okay. Okay, so seven and seven, fourteen. I'm not going to do that. Seven take seven is zero. I'm not going to do that. Seven divided by seven is one. Did I even put one on my board? <laughs> I've already done it. I'm going to hold on to these. I don't want to use them. I'm going to pick up. Put them up the top, Nashi, so we can see them. Okay. Please be a one. Five. Three. That won't help me. I want a six. And anyway, because it's way off. Five plus eight is eleven. I crossed eleven. No, it's not. Five plus eight is not eleven. Five plus eight. Thirteen. Yeah. No. Hang on to them. Now, so that would be like this. Boom, 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 boom. 
Yeah, hang on. Hang on. Keep them at the top so we can see them on the camera. All right, Nashi, I need a five here. Mm. That's what I need. I need a zero five. Um, I'm going to hang on, it looks like. Yeah, I'll hang on to them. That doesn't help me. Okay, your turn. Six. I'm gonna hang on. Can I just ask you a question? What? Did you actually check if you could make six or did you just decide you uh, can't? Yeah. You're saying you can't make six by adding them, I agree. Is there anything else you can do? Eight minus two is six. And that means? Now she's the winner. Okay, so that's our website, guys. If you want to check out more of our games, they're on there. Uh, there's over 60 games we've got up there now with videos showing you how to play. So that's five in a row. All you need is paper, something to write with, and a deck of cards. My advice is when you play a second, third, fourth time, use your old game boards to help you design the new ones. Because then you can look and see, oh, look, 10 does seem to be a popular number. Remember the time you played, Nashi, what number did you put in the middle the first time you played? 33. And then we looked and we said, oh, 33 doesn't seem to be getting crossed off. So that's a really good way of collecting data to see which numbers are getting hits on them and which numbers aren't getting hits on them. So I uh, hope you enjoy it and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.